Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at this Lippert self-adjusting electric trailer brake kit. This kit is going to provide the driver side and passenger side electric trailer brake assemblies for a 4,400 pound capacity axle. These are 10 inches in diameter by two and a quarter inch wide. And so these are going to work for most standard hub and drum assemblies, including the Lippert. Uh, these will work for wheels that are 13 inches to 15 inches in size. And they do have the four bolt um, brake flange configuration. So they are going to be very easy to mount onto your axles with that four bolt uh, brake flange. Uh, this is going to uh, require hardware to get it installed and that hardware is not included but we do have it available here at our um, website here at eTrailer.com. So if you're not familiar, electric brakes are going to be much easier to get installed and they do offer more user control than your hydraulic brakes uh, because you don't have to worry about a brake actuator or brake lines. Uh, these are going to uh, only require an electric brake controller which we do sell separately here at our website as well. <laughs> they have these two wires here on the back side. Uh, one is going to uh, a ground, the other is going to go to your brake feed for power. They're both red uh, and you can use either wire for either function so you don't have to worry about getting those mixed up. These assemblies are self-adjusting. You can tell that because we've got the wire here that's going down to our lever um, down by our adjuster and that's going to uh, make sure that our brakes adjust as we're braking to deliver optimum performance and braking power. You don't need to manually adjust them after the initial setup. Uh, there is uh, access holes on each assembly uh, down here, and that's going to allow you to get them adjusted for that initial adjustment. And then those included plugs will cover up those access holes so we don't have to worry about dirt and grime uh, getting on our assemblies. Uh, or uh, on our shoes. So uh, these brakes are lined with an automotive, uh, automotive grade friction material. Uh, this friction material is fully bonded to the shoe. It's not riveted, so it's going to give you a much longer life and more braking torque. Uh, if you are going to uh, install these and uh, you've lost the tag on there that tells you which side is which. Uh, the easy way to tell which assembly is your driver's side and which is your passenger side is to look at the length of the pad on the shoe. The shorter pad is always going to be your primary shoe and your primary shoe will always face the front of your trailer and so that will tell you that this is the driver's side and that is the passenger side. So uh, handy little tip there if you are uh, going to install them and you uh, are trying to figure out which one is which. Uh, but if you are looking to uh, switch out your electric trailer brakes, these are going to be a great option for you. And that completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.